I'm Irene Koronaki and I'm an associate professor in the School of Mechanical Engineering. Uh, also, I'm uh, the director of Laboratory of Applied Thermodynamics, which is one of the oldest laboratories in the National Technical University of Athens. Our field of interest is the design, analysis, simulation and optimization of a wide range of topics in the field of thermodynamics and energy sector of engineering, like thermodynamic systems and cycles, open-air evaporative air conditioning systems using liquid and solid absorbents, heat exchanger performance for shore and marine applications, solar thermal hybrid energy systems, thermal cryocooler steering engines, injector cooling units and combined absorption uh, units. Several uh, experimental setups have been constructed and installed in the lab in order to validate the developed codes and to promote the research in up-to-date energy fields. The NTUA Laboratory of Applied Thermodynamics is a pioneering risk in the study of thermal and cryocooler steering uh, engines. Many codes have been developed for the thermodynamic analysis and a solo uh, 161 steering CHP unit is installed in the lab here for the thermodynamic analysis and optimization of steering engines. They are used for shore applications, especially for electrical power production, for marine applications in submarines and in the space industry. A solar cooling system is installed in order to examine the potential of thermal storage and solar cooling under Athens climatic conditions. The cooling effect is produced using a single-stage two-bed zeolite water adsorption chiller. The system is evaluated in terms of solar collectors, useful energy production, heat stored in the intermediate buffer and cooling system's performance. It consists of nine main components, vacuum tube solar collectors, photovoltaic thermal collectors, buffer storage tank, an adsorption chiller, a latent thermal storage tank with uh, phase uh, change materials for high enthalpy uh, water, latent thermal storage tank with PCM for low enthalpy water used in the circulation of a Georgian chiller, a dry cooler, and electrical resistance and pumps. Another unit is a liquid desiccant cooling unit. It is a solar thermal driven cooling system which provides air conditioning and dehumidification only with water and lithium chloride salt. The system uses water as a cooling medium and lithium chloride aquasia solution as a desiccant. It is an environmental friendly unit uh, as well as with the previous one with zero ozone depletion and a global warming potential. Another unit is a rotary adsorption dehumidification system. This type of system allows drying the air very efficiently down to almost 0% of relative humidity. Systems like this have a wide and varied scope in food industry, libraries, museums, production of semiconductors and production of pharmaceutical products.